Hey guys, it's Chris here. Now, another one of my re-reviews are the V19 Torrent. I can't remember what planet or system it was built on. It was not Kuan, I know that, but... Um... <coughs> but, yeah. Um... It is a medium to heavy fighter of the Republic. At least, as far as I know. It has some pretty heavy firepower, but... Well... The armor of it and the maneuverability of it wasn't very impressive, so... Yeah. Anyway, the set number is 7674. Um, it comes with two instruction books, which I think is a bit... Uh, let's see now, before, I say, before I'm saying too much, with the last pages of it. Okay, there are like 45 pages in the first book, and I don't know how many in the second. Just about the same. Um, so, well, they could include it all in one book, but... Well, as you know, Lego. Yeah. Um, this set comes with actually only one minifigure, but it was pretty usual for Lego to do that with the Republic units. And this thing, it is a clone pilot. Don't mind the visor. I gave him that myself and added modification, if you will. Um, well, you pretty much know them already, but it is a regular, almost regular clone chest plate. Back printing clone face, uh, pilot helmet with those, uh, symbol, with those Republic symbols on it, and that yellow piece up there, um, a, a funny and remarkable thing about this one, uh, but this one set is, though, that, well, it came with this, I mean, seriously, it came with a blaster rifle, when regularly they only have either no weapons, max a blaster rifle, and now there was a blaster, uh, sorry, blaster pistol, and now it was actually, well, a blaster rifle, pretty much a sniper rifle, if you will, um, I don't know if I already showed you the regular clone face, but, um, yeah, well, enough said about him, now on to the fighter itself, well, actually, in the very start, there we go, actually, in the very start, when, when this fighter had just come out in 2008, I didn't really want to have it, um, I thought it was a bit like, meh. I don't know, um, and, well, um, to some point, I reg I regret that I say that, and that I'm very happy that I got it, um, but it was also quite an expensive investment, because, well, compared to the number of pieces and all that in this set, then it's not really impressive, uh, compared to the price. Oh yeah, don't mind this, it came with two extra flag firing, uh, flick firing missiles, sorry. I don't know why I said flag, but um, it came with two extra flag firing missiles, and well, I just put them up here to avoid them being lost. Um, as you can also see, there is a mechanism for shooting them off. And yeah, well, it works. They're all the same on the other side as well. Um, well. Now there is time for the landing gear on this thing, and actually this set, it is pretty heavy, and pretty durable. So, <clears throat> and, well to just give you a kind of a sense, a 3 degree view, if, a 360 degree view if you will. So, now, we'll do this. We can pull this out. The, uh, with the use of that little pin there. Here you see. Actually, got illuminated a lot better now. So, with that little pin there, um, and then if you are really lazy, and just want them to get in there easily, you can just do this as well. And... Can still get my finger on there so it doesn't touch the ground um we'll just for the fun of it put in that clone pilot he has his controls there and a blue seat blue chair okay i'll just put him like that and oh what the heck 
Okay, I'll do that after the, re the review is over, otherwise it's going to take too much time. So, just use your imagination, say he's in there for now. The one thing that I don't like about this big tail wing, though, is that you look here and you look there. They could they could do something like uh, uh, like having two of these tops and then putting these putting these uh, holes in 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 uh, what's it called in against each other. As I know Lego, they can easily do that. So. Now, you might wonder what this thing's for, those gears, and this one. I'll show you just in a minute. Because this is the one, this is the main feature of the, the set itself. Um, but for that, though, I'm going to need some space. So, <clears throat> oh, just going to take this thing. And let me see. Once. Hopefully you can see this. Alright, you can. See, the one thing about that tail wing is pretty fun. Because it can go down, and as soon as you do that, the very me mechanics in here... There. This also has an effect on the landing gear. As you can see the landing gear is out now. Let me just pull this up and the landing gear is gone. So, this is what it looks like when, well, when, what's it called? When it's, uh, when it's all standing up, right? Oh, then I'll just see if I can't. Damn it, it's too heavy, otherwise I would have it stand by itself, but, yeah, um, it's pretty big like this, we'll just do this to get the wings right, um, but as I said, this set is pretty big actually, um, the width of this thing is actually larger than the Republic dropship carrying the ATOT, believe it or not, um, although I don't have that on me right now, I can show you This compared to this. See what I mean? Okay, I was a bit wrong. It's not as big as the uh, as the uh, dropship, just the gunship. It's uh, a little bit bigger than the gunship. Yeah, I just did this again. Um, now that being said, then now I do understand why it was so expensive at the time. Uh, now it's probably either more expensive or cheaper. It's about five years old, so. Excuse me. Um, but, well, what can I say about it? This set's just... Well, it's very great. I'm very happy that I got it. Actually, once I had it hanging up there and definitely not recommend it when bumping your head into it and it falls down and goes kaboom on the floor. So, <clears throat> yeah. But anyway, guys, I'll be off. See you next time in another review. Now, please rate, comment and subscribe. Goodbye, please watch some of my other videos, more will be coming soon. If I get my partnership up running, that is, I might actually only do YouTube videos, and yeah. So, but anyway, I hope you guys will have fun, and uh, yeah. Bye, people.